Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It has been a very, 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 very long time since I've actually sat down and filmed a video. So I am so out of practice. I'm finally back. I, uh, it's so good to be back, but I'm so sorry it's took me so long to actually sit down and film. I think my next video will be more of a sit down explanation as to where the hell I've been. Before this gets any longer, I just want to say I am okay, don't worry, I've not fallen off the face of the earth, a few people have been asking where I've been. I'm actually really excited for today's video because this company has actually reached out and messaged me and wanted to work with me and this company is the reason why my YouTube channel did actually start to get subscribers. Oh, this is so hefty, it's actually everything5pounds.com. This was one of the first major hauls I uploaded and I think it got maybe over 30,000 views which for a small YouTuber is absolutely insane so if you came to my channel because of this company thank you so much but like I said I was absolutely over the moon to receive an email from these guys saying that they wanted to send me some free bits and wanted me to test out their clothing because they'd seen the video so that was an absolute honor so first of all thank you so much everything5pounds.com thank you it just means a lot I have ordered from everything five pounds multiple times and they've been insane and I do actually have a discount code it's my first discount code so it means a lot but I will add it on the screen if you want to get yourself I think it's five percent off I'm not too sure but feel free to use that code it is only available for a limited time so use it fast I'm aware that the company actually sent me some pieces for free which again thank you so so much and then I couldn't help but resist and buy a few more things because I love their site so let me get into it the first thing I got is actually jacket I believe this is a I want to say large yeah it's a large which is a size 10 which it's not exactly a 10 but I wanted to give it a go and it's basically just this jacket and it kind of looks like a vintage style um rain mat I believe and it feels quite soft um it's quite lightweight so I wouldn't say it was a thick winter jacket but I really like the look of it really love the color so I'm gonna try that on I'm gonna see what I think guys I do apologize if my try on clips completely suck I am not a great youtuber and I'm working with limited space so bear with me I just chucked this on over the crap dress I'm wearing right now and I really really like this you may notice some of the poppers have come off because me being the forceful I am has just completely ripped it open and that was a bad idea so I will just stick those back on this is really really cute I I actually like this I feel like with some black skinny jeans and just like an oversized t-shirt I feel like this just adds a pop of colour and it's super super comfy I think it's really really cute oh my god are these real pockets <gasps> guys they're real pockets I really like this. I'm more than happy to pay five pounds for this because it is very, very cute. Also, I'm not gonna go through the prices of stuff because in case you haven't guessed, everything is five pounds. What have we got here? So this is a size small medium, which is an eight to 10. And ooh, this is soft. Okay, so it has a tie. I wanted this to be slightly oversized, but I think this is gonna be quite fitted. It's just a shirt. The model wore it open and then tied in the middle, which I thought looked super, super cute. And yeah, I like the look of this. Big collar, really, really soft. I'd probably just wear this open with some mom jeans maybe. But this is super, super soft. It is a little bit more fitted than I would like a shirt to be, but I really like it, you know? Um, let me just see what this looks like, because this is how the model wears it. She probably doesn't, to be fair. I'm probably completely butchering her look, but I think this is really, really cute, you know? And to be fair, I probably wouldn't use the tie. I'd probably just wear it maybe as like an extra layer for a day where it's a little bit more chilly again, black skinny jeans, because that is just my go-to, and maybe a white t-shirt or something, just open like that. I feel like it's quite cute. And again, for five pound, it is not bad at all. Wow, this feels quite heavy. This is a size medium, which is a 10 to 12. This is a really weird but nice fabric. Kind of feels like a coat. Oh, this is so nice. It says, I feel like, and then on the back it says, I feel like... What the hell does that say? Does it say Kylie? I'm dyslexic, so this really doesn't help. Can someone figure out what this says, please? <laughs> I really like the feeling of this. This is definitely a me jacket. It's got little poppers on it. I'm so excited to try this. The quality is amazing for this. I'm so in love with this jacket. I like how it's like quite oversized. It does have the elasticated sleeves, which is quite cool as well. Oh my God, it also has pockets. This makes me so happy. If someone can figure out what the back says, that would be absolutely great and the best thing about this is it just about covers my butt so I could wear some cheap 
rubbish leggings and no one will see. I am so happy with this. Can you believe that this was five pounds? Oh, I feel my <laughs> hamster cheeks wobbling. Again, this is so heavy. Don't remember buying another jacket and this is a large. This is a 10 to 12 in the color charcoal. It's in a zip bag. Oh, it's like a blanket. Oh, I remember this now, yeah. This is something I saw and I was like, I wanna be a nice hot potato on the couch in winter with a nice cup of tea wearing this and I'm really excited. So it's like this, how would you describe that? It's kind of like that teddy, you know the coats, not teddy bear coats, oh, I don't know what I'm trying to say. Either way, it's really, really soft. It just says oversized. Oh, it's actually a jacket. I thought it was just like a big pullover and it's got these huge poppers on it. I'm probably not showing you this well at all, but really cute stitching. I love the look of this and it's quite heavy, so I reckon that's gonna be super, super warm. I still can't believe that this is a jacket. I thought it was just like a big comfy potato sack that looks cute. Oh, the sleeves are cropped, okay. I feel like it's something that one of the characters of Once Upon a Time would wear. <laughs> this is so, so soft. Again, most of you are probably looking at this like, oh my God, it has pockets as well. <laughs> I could put snacks in it. I'm just so happy with it. Yes, it does kind of look like a big potato sack, but again, with some black skinny jeans, because that's all I wear, and my Dot Martens, I feel like this would be my go-to comfy potato sack. <laughs> I feel like I'm really making it sound by calling it potato sack, but I absolutely adore this. I'm not doing it any justice, just take my word for it, this is boss. <laughs> Okay, the next item, I'm gonna be completely honest. I don't really get my hopes up when it comes to jeans from every other company apart from Topshop. I don't really shop in Topshop apart from jeans. I have a really odd shape and buying jeans for my figure is pretty much impossible, but I thought I'm gonna give it a go. If their jeans don't fit me, it's not because they suck, it's because my figure sucks. <laughs> but this is size eight washed denim blue. Also, I'm probably not an eight anymore because I like too many donuts and I've gained a lot of weight. <laughs> they feel quite soft. They do feel like my Joni jeans from Topshop, so I'm not complaining. They are very stretchy, so they could potentially fit my big bum, but the waist might be a little bit too big for me. They're quite thin. They are more like jeggings, but I'm happy to give them a go. And they're just this skinny, jeans i've got a revelation <laughs> the jeans fit me they actually fit and i'm absolutely gobsmacked okay they they are a little bit baggier at the back but that's because i have a big bum and a little waist but they freaking fit and they were only five pounds oh i'm gonna have to try and stand on a chair to show you because clearly my setup is not youtube ready oh this is a health risk don't try this at home kids look they fit, they fit my super long legs. Check. They fit my bigger thighs. Check. They fit my bigger butt. Check. And they fit my smaller waist. <laughs> I'm gonna get down before I actually like break my neck. I'm so happy with these. For five pounds, I've got some acid wash jeans that are actually really comfy. So the next thing I got in a size eight as well. I clearly was feeling optimistic about my weight gain. <laughs> but, oh, this is quite nice. I love denim skirts and this is like a gray one and I don't have a gray one and I like this because it was quite long and a little bit wider instead of fitted. Hopefully that will fit again. It's quite stretchy so hopefully that will look quite nice I think. This definitely does obviously need a, an iron but I love this. I feel like this is so flattering because I don't really have much of a shape. It kind of gives me a little shape because it goes out. It's super stretchy. It's super comfortable. It does kind of fit to my bum a little bit and then flares out. I do actually really like this. And again, for only five pound, this is great. It's so comfy. It fits perfectly, but I've got more than enough room to go and eat like 10 pizzas. So I am really impressed with this. I love the distressed look at the bottom. And because it's a gray color, it's not completely washing my pale ass body out. So I'm very impressed. And it's a very flattering length, even though you can't see. <laughs> so the next thing, it is quite girly, which is not really like me. And it's very spring, very summer. Again, not like me, but I thought for your girls out there who are a little bit girlier, I will give it a go. This is actually lovely. It's kind of like a thick chiffony fabric and slightly silky. And it's just got these cute little cap sleeves. And basically it ties in the middle and it is a crop top. I'm not gonna be able to show it you till I try it on. I don't have any boobs at all, so usually this style doesn't suit me, but I thought just give it a go because for these days where I'm melting, 
I could try and look like a girl, so I thought I'd give that a go. This to me looks like something that you would pay a fortune for in maybe Topshop, so I'm gonna give that a go because that is really, really cute. So I've just kept the jeans on, but I'm wearing this little crop top, and in all honesty, I think this is so cute. I wouldn't wear it with these jeans, um, but it's really flattering. It might not look it on the camera, but for me who doesn't do girly stuff, this is actually really cute, but I do have a couple faults with it. I'm not gonna lie. Quality is amazing, but because I don't have any boobs whatsoever, this isn't really fitting me, but then I feel like it is too wide for anyone who does have boobs because I've obviously had to put a top underneath because it is very, Hmm. How is, just very wide, <laughs> you know what I mean? So I feel like if you had like a cute little lace bandeau top or a lace bralette, it'd look very, very cute. But I feel like the big flowy sleeves are really flattering. Um, I'll try and make this tighter and I'll see how it looks because I actually would wear this, you know. I think that this is super cute, maybe with some white flowy pants or... I'm not sure, but it is really, really cute. I do actually really like this. So I just feel like the quality is so good for what it is and you wouldn't expect this to be five pounds so yeah I'm actually really happy with this I just wish that it was a little bit closer together so my boobs wouldn't be out. The next thing I'm so excited about because this style of pants I'm obsessed with I got these in a size A and oh, these feel so so nice these are originally from Pretty Little Thing size A and the reason why I probably like these so much is I already have these in a grey <laughs> grey colour but they're just this high waisted really 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 comfy pants and they've got little stripes down the side there's like a multicoloured pink one and a yellow one and they just flare out at the bottom these things are so comfy I absolutely love this style of pants and these are a little bit funky because they're like got this metallic thread in it so I'm excited I feel like these I could rock just chilling at home eating more donuts <laughs> or you could wear these with a cute little crop top on a night out so I'm excited to try those. Finally is the pants. As predicted they are perfect. I'm not gonna be able to show you them properly I'm so so sorry but they fit my waist perfectly. I thought the fabric would be majorly itchy but it's actually not that bad you know. It does have a little bit of an itch to it just because of the thread but quality again is insane and they actually fit my long ass legs so I am going to show you. I love the very subtle stripes down there. I think they are fab so I'm just going to climb up on the chair again so say a prayer I don't die. They're basically just wide pants. They go all the way down to my foot and they're super super comfy i absolutely love these so that's actually everything i picked up from everything five pounds.com this time and i'm so glad that i chose to come back to youtube with this video because i love their clothing site i i'm losing my voice already jesus <laughs> i'm so out of practice I absolutely love the clothing brand. I've never really had any issues with their pieces. You can get shoes on there for a fiver, which are absolutely insane. I didn't get any shoes this time because I already own way too many, so maybe next time. But again, just want to say a huge thank you to everything5pounds.com for reaching out to me. That is insane and yeah, thank you so, so much. And hopefully you guys can fall in love with the site as much as I have. So let me know down below which pieces you liked, if you think I should return some, even though I won't be because I love them all, but in case you want to input, feel free. The returns is always super simple. Shipping doesn't take too long. The price you cannot complain with at all. So I can't really rave about the company much more. Thank you so much for watching today. Please give it a massive thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below and subscribe if you are not. I'll leave all my social media down below as well and fingers crossed it won't be like months before my next upload. So yeah, thank you for bearing with me if you're still subscribed. <laughs> I will see you all in my next one.